Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, a little early morning video there. Was reading some of that wrestling news. And WWE Raw got a 2.26 rating. Second lowest rating in a year. Um, and they are lucky, fucking lucky, that they got a 2.26. Last month they went down to a 2.20. Very, very, very lucky to not go fucking below a two with the garbage friggin' product that they aired Monday night there. A show revolving around the plant. You know, the opening segment, it's a plant. The main event, it's Ambrose getting revenge for his plant. This is... Like something you would see on the little kid's cartoon or something there. Very, very, very terrible. What's next? They're going to argue about a bag of chips or something like this there. Roman Reigns is going to come out. Who ate my chips? This was for me and my family. AJ is going to come out crying. He's going to apologize because he ate the chips or something. Is that the... The big storytelling that they give us on Raw there. You know, big storylines on Raw. We used to get Big Boss Man dragging Big Show's casket, you know, the father's casket all over the place. It doesn't have to be extreme like this there, but you go from good stories from back in the day, dog. Hogan and Savage, a story that lasted a full year, you know what I'm saying? By the time the match would happen, people would, you know, they'd be like this, they're freaking out and shit. Now you get a bag of fucking, well not a bag of chips, but you get a plant, you know. That's your fucking stories in 2016. Motherfucker needs to get revenge for a fucking plant. Embarrassing, very, very, very embarrassing. And the matches on this show were fucking horrible. You know, Sin Cara beating Rusev in a minute. Motherfucking Goldust, Fandango, all of that fucking garbage. They are lucky, lucky that they got a 2.26. You know what I'm saying? Keep it up, WWE. You're going to get a fucking point nine if this shit continues. Very bad. Very, very, very bad Raw. You know what I'm saying? They're lucky that they got this, but they deserved even less than that. Wait till the sports comes back there in October, fucking November and shit. If they're still putting on the bad product, they're going to go way below the fucking two mark if they keep putting out this fucking trash as their product there. You suck, WWE. It's time to step your fucking game up, you god darn idiots. Until next time, peace.